Welcome back to a beautiful Lanzarote and I'm outside one of my favourite hotels, the H10 Rubicon Palace, because Sarah and Julian got in touch and said, we're stopping here for a week. Do you want to come and have a look at one of the rooms at the Rubicon Palace? Now, it's been a while since I've been to this hotel, so we are going to go and have a little wander around, have a little sneaky peek. I'll show you a little bit of the hotel and then we're going to go and see Sarah and Julian and have a look at a room at the five star H10 Rubicon Palace. Come on, let's go. Well, with no time to spare, I headed straight down in the glass lift to get to the bottom level, because that's where all the action is. When you get down there, you're met with a beautiful sort of pond area with a koi carp, and you know I love a water feature in a hotel. But let's go and have a look at the pool. Now, this is the main pool. There's quite a few pools here, but I only had a look at this one. And just look at it. It's absolutely huge. Not only has it got on a restaurant that looks over the pool, which I'm going to show you in a minute, but it's also got a little boat. As I've got my sea legs, I went up the little ramp to have a little look at the views from here. And I tell you what, they're spectacular. Not only do they look all the way over the pool, but you can see the sea and you can even see over to Fuerteventura from here. Look at it. Now it was early doors and people were getting ready for breakfast and not many places you can go for breakfast and meet a man on stilts but I did manage to have a little sneaky peek inside the breakfast area and I tell you what, everything looks so fresh and so nice. If there's one thing that H10 do well, it's the food. And we'll ask Julian and Sarah what they think as well. But just look at the place. This is another one of the restaurants. This was the main buffet restaurant. So there's a couple of places to go for breakfast and there's loads of different restaurants for you to enjoy here. And this one had your fresh show cooking as well, doing pancakes, omelets, you name it. They had the absolute lot. Of course, you can get yourself a full English or if you wanna get healthy, there's plenty of fruit. Just look at the colors, absolutely beautiful. Now before I go and have a look at Julian and Sarah's room, I thought I'd have a little look upstairs because there's a beautiful piano bar here. You can grab yourself a drink, whether it be an alcoholic drink or a coffee and just sit down and relax. The staff here are fantastic, getting everything ready for you, open all day long. I tell you what, if you're all inclusive, you are gonna be spoiled for choice here. Loads of different places to enjoy. And you can sit here or you can take your drink out onto the beautiful terrace. And the views from the terrace are just just breathtaking. Just look at them. Now I said there was a number of restaurants and this one is the Italian. Just look how modern this place is and you can eat here included. All you need to do is book into the different restaurants or enjoy the main buffet restaurant. But just look at the decoration, loads of places to sit inside and outside and look at that pizza oven. Imagine having a fresh pizza here, sitting inside and enjoying it or taking it out on the beautiful terrace and watching the world go by. What do you reckon? I told you I'd show you the restaurant that is just above the pool, overlooking the pool, and this is the American Diner. Here you can get all your meat, your steaks, your ribs. I'll tell you what, this would definitely be the one that Mr. Travelon would be dining in on a regular basis. Not only will you get fantastic food, but these views are to die for. There are so many different restaurants like the Japanese restaurant and different places that I could show you, but I just didn't have the time. I had to go and have a look at a room and I'll tell you what, I was excited to as well. But did you know here at the H10 Rubicon Palace, they've even got a spa. Now this is available to guests, but if you're stopping in Playa Blanca, it's open to the public as well. So you can pop down here and pay to use this incredible spa. Now all I wanted to do was get in and relax, but I had to go and see Julian and Sarah because they wanted to show me their room. So let's go and have a look at a room at the five star H10 Rubicon Palace. Come on, let's go. Right then, it's absolutely beautiful up here and it's not like corridors. It's like an outside area. The place is absolutely huge. And they said it was room 6094, which is this one here. Let's give it a knock and hopefully they're in. Hello. Hello, how are you? Oh, I'm good, thank you. Wow, look at this place. Are you going to show me around? Yeah, I'll show you around. Brilliant. Yeah. Right, let's go. 
Right then, so right. we're here at the Rubicon Palace. This is beautiful. So introduce yourselves. Who are you? I'm Sarah. I'm Julian. Sarah and Julian, and where are you from? We're from Broadstairs in Kent. Broadstairs Kent, in yeah. Kent. And you're here right, for so how long? We're here for seven nights. Seven nights. Wow. And you only arrived yesterday. Yesterday. We did. We so did. we're in the fresh room? Yes. yes. Wow, right, so let's start here, because I can see myself here. It's got a lovely mirror just for when you're going out, so just to make sure your hair's all right before yeah, you leave. Yeah. I mean, me and you definitely <laughs> need to check our hairs before that. But what's this here? Is it just a mirror? No, no this is a so... double wardrobe. Oh, right, okay, so you've this is got... all your storage here. Yeah, you've got all... plenty of storage in here. Oh, God, you have as well. Absolutely loads. That is so... enough. <laughs> Don't worry, you've got the Hawaiian shirts and everything That's in it. there, haven't you? Fantastic. And there's a um, safe... Well, so you've got your safe, yeah. you've got everything in there. Yeah. Brilliant. Yeah. So all your storage is there, um, yeah. which is storage ample. Here. And then you've got a little bit here to put all your luggage and stuff. Uh, three sets of drawers up here. Yeah. And then uh, these open up as a cupboard. Ah, and right, your okay. Fridge there. Oh, right, yeah, let's have a look. The is there anything in it? Well, something you might like in there. A, bo a bottle, bottle of posh water. water. Yeah. That is posh yeah, water as well, water. that is. It's not the blue one, but it is posh. If it comes in a glass bottle, that's posh water. Yeah. So that's included your water, but you're all inclusive, no? Yes. yes. So do you get anything else in the room or just water? Yeah, you get um, oh, little welcome, welcome chocolates. chocolates. Yeah. yeah. Have you ate them yet? We haven't. No. Do you, do you know what? I think it, just be, it, it must just be me and my family because they would be gone <laughs> within the minute that we walked in the room <laughs> and I would have down, they'd have been down my neck. Mm. Yeah. They'd have been gone. So this, I mean, this is the room here. So you've got a little sofa here because mm. just behind your head there, you've got the TV. Yeah. yeah. So is there any English channels there or have you not looked? There is, we there had is. it on this morning. Oh, yeah, there you go. We were watching go. Sky News uh, this morning. And, so, yeah. and uh, also what I found on there was um, Bullseye with Jim Bowen. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. happy days, well, I mean. It was, I felt, I felt, yeah. That's, that's exactly like, what you need, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Wow, it's gorgeous. So you've got yeah. your bed over here, yeah. and I, I love the decoration in the hotel anyway. Um, the H10, just uh, the way they decorate everything is just amazing. And just above your head there is a fan, but you don't actually need it because it's fully air conditioned in here, no? Yes. Yeah. And it is really cool really as well. Really cool. Yeah. Because it's quite warm outside today, yeah. but it's yeah. so cool in here. I love it. It's sort of, I mean, it's only a small room, but you've got like this sort of living area that you can sort of just chill in as well. Yeah, yes. if you want to, yeah. Yeah, yeah if you want to. Yeah. And yeah. I can see out there, there's a massive balcony. We've got to go and have a look okay. out there as well. Yeah, we can oh, show you. So what have we got this side? This side, bathroom. you've got, again, you've got a dressing table. Right, okay. And uh, a little bit more storage. storage. Yeah. Um, and you've got tea and coffee making facilities. Tea and coffee yeah. making yep. facilities. Fantastic. Yep. Plenty of plug sockets. There yeah. you go. And they've got the USBs in as well, yeah. which is always handy, isn't yeah. it? So if you bring your plugs handy. and stuff. Yeah. And then the bathroom's behind you. Yeah. Well, it's only small. I don't think we're both going to fit in there, are we? Let's have well, a look. Will we? I think you will. Oh, actually, yeah, we will. Blimey, no, it's actually quite big. It's a beautiful bathroom. It's massive as well. Yeah, yeah. you've got a shower wow. and a bath. Oh, wow, okay. Lovely. So it's only a small bath. I don't think you'd fit in there, Julian, to be honest. <laughs> Me and you wouldn't be fitting anywhere near there, but it's a... Uh, you've got the rainfall shower as well. Yes. And of course, I can see the H10. They always put the lovely soaps and stuff like that. Yeah. And you get these little shower caps and tissues. And here you go, comb for you, Julian. Me and you, you definitely need one of them, don't we? Bloody hell. And as the ladies always ask, a hairdryer. And it's quite a good one, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It's not like your cheap, cheap no. usual hotel one, yeah. is it? Yeah. It's quite nice. I like them lights as well. But let's head out that way because, well, the best, the best is still to come, isn't it? So this yeah. bed, this bed looks comfortable as well. It is so comfortable. We slept, slept a like a lot. really. Yeah. And yeah. what I like is sort of the minute you open your eyes, look, you're just out there, aren't you? You're just literally yeah. right on the balcony, so you yeah. can literally wake up and look out, and the sun's shining through. And then talking to balconies and the sun shining through, we've got to get out there. Right then, let's have a look out here. I cannot wait to see out here. Oh, wow. wow. This is just beautiful. This is amazing. Huge, big, giant balcony. It is, isn't it? It's, it, it's, it's like the whole it. length of the room. And you've got two chairs there. Yes. Yeah. Two sun beds. Two sun beds. Yeah. So if you don't want to go down the pool, you can sort of chill out and relax yeah. here, can't you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Oh wow, I really like this. I've um, got to I've got to look at these views. The look view at is absolutely amazing. Wow. So you can see you've got Montana Rocker there. Are you gonna yeah. walk up there? Actually walk right up to the top of that mountain. It only takes about 30 minutes. Yeah. It's really good. I reckon you should do that and let me know how you get on. And then yeah. you've got a few restaurants down here because this place is full of restaurants. It is. It's yeah. like a little yeah. village. So you've got a little bistro there. Now you said that you ate in that bistro, no? We did yesterday. Yeah. Any good? Very yeah, good. Yeah, very good. But wow, look at this. So you've got, I mean, this is one of a few one pools. One of the pools, yes. And this is only a small one. Yeah. Um, I wonder if this is an adult's only one because I don't I see don't any know, kids down really there. It's really quiet as well. And it is so pretty. And you've got a sea view as well. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what? I think you've struck gold here with this room. I mean, the views are just, they're probably some of the best views I've seen in this hotel. Look, with the mountain that side, all the way over to Marina Rubicon, um, over there. Playa Flamingo You can Beach. see Playa yeah. Flamingo Beach yeah. just there. Yeah. And if you sort of just lean over a bit and don't fall off the balcony, <laughs> you can see over to Fuerteventura, can't you? Right then, so you've only been here a short time, but I'm gonna sit you down here and I'm gonna ask you a couple of questions about the hotel so far, including the food. Um, and then I'm just gonna sort of sit and chill out with you two and just enjoy these views. So you grab a seat there and we'll have a little chat. So you got in touch and said, come and have a look at this room. And I'll tell you did. what, I'm she super did. glad yeah. you did. So you've only literally arrived yesterday. Yeah. Um, so we said that you've had lunch yesterday in the bistro there. Yes. You had dinner last night? We yes. did. Have Where dinner. was that? At the main restaurant. At the main buffet restaurant. Yes. So what was that like? That was great. Was that nice? What did you have? Um, I had a meat feast. Sort of. A bit of steak, a bit of a pork, uh, a bit of roast hog. Uh, it's great. Yeah, the meat selection. Roast pork, hog sounds good. Pork it was, and, yeah. Um, well, you can't, I mean, even even though it's a buffet and you do overindulge on all of these, you can eat healthy, really. What uh, what sort of things do they have for brekkie? They had really nice sausages. So they had the proper sausage. sausage. The proper, proper bangers. Proper bangers. That's yeah. it. That's yeah. what you need, isn't proper it? Proper bangers. So you're all inclusive here. So you've got all yeah. your food and drink included. Yes. Did you yes. see any entertainment last night? Yeah, there's a dinner and a show that you can go there to. There is a here. dinner and show. Yes. I've been to that, you know, it's not that bad. Yeah. And you get like a little meal. Yes. And was that included? Yes. Yes. Yeah, you uh, get... You've got three restaurants were included, like yeah. the Italian, yeah. uh, the steakhouse, and the uh, evening show with meal. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. yeah. So you're going to try all of them? Yes. Yeah. We, 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 booked, we booked them yesterday. Wow. Yeah. Nice yeah. You're here for a good time, yes. not a long time. So make yeah, the most of it. Safe. And that's why yeah. you've got everything well, we organised, booked into yeah. all your restaurants. Well, listen, you know, as you know, um, when you do show me around your room, you do get a little present. I know you know oh. I get a present. Yeah. Maybe yeah. you do as well, I don't know. But um, I do appreciate that you show me around and I'm gonna get you something to wait there. Right then, it's only a room for two, this is. That's why we've only got two chairs and one table. But Mrs. Travel On, as always, when she sends me down here or when you lot invite me, she said, yeah. well, if you go in, you have to take a present. So I've got a present for you there. So get that open right, and sorry. show everybody. Right. Because you're now officially part of what they call the mug club. Okay, oh. so you got oh. my ugly mug on your oh, mug. Show it there, look. look There's one that. for you as well, look. look. look There's one for you Brilliant. as well. Get it open, look. So you're now officially part of the mug club. And I forgot something else as well. Oh, oh. oh. oh way! Oh, oh way! way. I tell you what, no way, no. you give them a mug and all they want is the bloody stickers, yeah. look. So oh, these, these are what I give out when people catch up with me when I'm out I on the lives. Yeah. yeah, so yeah. when they yeah. see me on the lot, you get one of these as well, of course. Wow. So I say, you got my mug on your mug and you got my face now on your case. So there's a couple of stickers for oh, your luggage as well. You'll never lose your luggage now because you got Mr. Travel On's face on there. Brilliant. But no, honestly, yeah. I really do appreciate all the support with the channel because I know you're watching all the yeah. time. Yeah. And uh, just showing people the rooms because it's good to get a perspective from real people yeah. rather than oh, me course. just bowling around and sneaking around in the morning. Yeah, real people on holiday. Uh, you've been here a few times and I stuff have, before, yeah. but this is your first time, first isn't time it? First time in Lanzarote, yeah. So you've been here 24 hours. What do you think so far? It's brilliant. I love Fantastic. it. Fantastic. Brilliant, brilliant. It's, it's great. Well, yeah. listen, you have an amazing week. Enjoy your holiday. From me, Mr. Travel On, it's a big goodbye. Don't forget, if you want to show me around, all you have to do is get in contact. And if I'm here, I'll come down and see you, just like these two. It wasn't that painful, was it? No, it no, wasn't. No, no. It's a bit of no. fun. It's a bit of fun. So yeah, for me, yeah. it's goodbye. And from these two lovely people, bye. bye. See you bye. later. <laughs>